and um, flip them every 15 minutes. And make sure they uh, brown on both sides, and uh, and be careful when you do because the oven is 350 degrees. And if you want to, you can use uh, no stick, but usually it probably um, won't stick very much. And about the same time as your mashed potatoes are done, your carrots will probably be done too. And um, add just a dash of brown sugar. Um, if you want it to be really sweet, then add about a couple teaspoons. There's really no actual um, measurement that you have to put in it. It just brings out sweetness and it's really good. So then you just wait for your chicken to get done, of course. And all right, now that your chicken is all done, um, first you need to actually make sure it's done and check um, the inside of it by just cutting it open with a butter knife or something. And just cut your chicken open. And if it's all white and no um, pink inside, then it's done. Okay. Oh, that smells exquisite. Exquisite. Okay, I'll have a Um, so, um, let's show them what it should look like. They're really covered with flour, as you can see. That just makes it taste better. Right there, see how it's white? Oh, it, there's a light in the way. Yep, that's white in the light right there. <clears throat> so right. See how it isn't uh, pink or anything? Alright, and they, they're really covered with flour, as you can see. That makes it, like I said, it makes it taste better. And um, it really prevents it from getting too moist. Uh, they're nice and... Um, the chicken sizzled when I, um, when I opened it, and, um, enjoy your chicken, and we'll have, um, your final meal in just a moment.